Today guys, I'm going to show you one of the best tricks in GTA 5 Online, and it's going to be how you guys can drive and never fall off your bike. This goes for BMXs, this goes for the Oppressor Mark 1, this goes for regular motorcycles. You guys will never fall off the bike. It's also pretty helpful in time trials too, because I know some of you guys hit a pole or something and fall right off. This will allow you to literally never fall off your bike as long as the bike does not get destroyed. It's literally the easiest thing ever a baby could do it. So before we get into the video, be sure to go check out my boy It's Jerry and my boy It's Joe down below in the description. We're going to do some more videos in the future. If you guys haven't checked out that hide and seek video that Joe and I uploaded, check it out. We're going to do some more videos just like that, but with more people. So be sure to check those out down below. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy the video and let's get into it. All right, to start this off, you need two people, you and a friend, or you can have three people, one person, and then you and your friend are doing the actual little trick. Super fun, super easy. Tell one of your friends to go and hop in any car that can hold more than one person. It has to be at least two if you're doing it with two people and at least a three-seater if you're doing it with three people. Tell them to bring the car over to you just like you can see in the video. So my friend is driving the car over to the casino entrance. All you wanna do is hop inside the back and tell your friend to just drive towards the casino door. And once he drives there, it'll pop up on his screen saying parking garage and penthouse garage. You don't want him to click anything. Tell him to just drive up there. Once he does that, all you want to do is get out of the car. It's that simple. So you guys are going to see me get out of the car right here. And then from that point, go and hop on your bike. And once you guys hop on your bike, you will not be able to fall off. It is not possible for you to fall off until you click triangle or the vehicle explodes. And it's honestly the easiest thing ever to do in GTA 5. It takes two seconds to do it. And honestly, when I was doing it, I had my alt account on my other PlayStation just sitting there with the car. And whenever I wanted to do it again, or if I died because my bike blew up or something, I just did it again in two seconds. And then there was no issues. And it's literally the easiest, most perfect little trick in GTA 5 because it works every time and anybody can do this. It's not hard at all. Now I'm going to show you guys from the other perspective. So this time I'm going to get my friend to do it. So then he will never fall off his bike. So what you would end up doing is getting in the car, obviously telling them to get inside the back or get inside the front. It does not matter where they get in. Just make sure you are the one driving it. And then all you got to do is just drive to the casino door just like this. You'll see this pop up at this point. Tell your friend to get out. And then once he's out of the car, you can back out of this menu and then you're good to go. He just has to get on his bike and then he's golden. And that's pretty much it. Now, we were testing it out to see if we could do it with only two people. So both of us will never fall off our bikes. But the second he gets back in this car, it reverts it. So then he will no longer be able to do it, but I was able to do it again. So I'm gonna show you guys how you could do it if you wanted to do it with three people. So now I have my second account is playing. And now you can see me and my friend Joe are standing here with our oppressors. That is also me driving that car on my other account. And all you gotta do is just you and your friend just get inside the car while that other person is driving. And if you wanna do it with four people, only one person will not be able to do this, and that's whoever is driving the actual vehicle. So you could see my friend Joe is literally just getting in the front, and then I just drive straight over here. Once he's on that screen, I just click triangle to get out. And now Joe and I can go and hop on our motorcycles, and we will never fall off. Now, the vehicles I would suggest doing this with, the Hakachu, the Body 801, the Oppressor Mark 1, and a BMX. They work immaculately with those vehicles. It'll work with all motorcycles, but with these vehicles, it's perfect because the Batty 801 and the Hakachu, you guys can actually just do really good wheelies and stuff like that and do some crazy cool tricks. Oppressor Mark 1 obviously is extremely fun. It's got the rocket boost, turn it back into a normal motorcycle, do some cool tricks. And of course, a BMX is just really fun to just, you know, drive around in like Los Santos. It's cool. But honestly, these are the best vehicles you could do this with. And it's really simple, really fun. And like I said, if your vehicle starts smoking, drive it into your Avenger, drive it inside of your garage or something like that. But once you do that, it will be reverted back. So you will have to go back to the casino and do the exact same thing again. That takes two seconds. Drive the car to the door. Just get out and get back on your bike. That's simple. And then you guys will be able to do this every single time with no issues whatsoever. Honestly, it's one of the best little tricks in the game, or I guess glitches in the game, because it just makes it more fun so you never fall off your bike because it happens a lot. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much going to wrap up the video for today. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy it, be sure to drop a like on it. Subscribe if you are new to the channel. Let me know if you guys had fun with this little trick slash glitch. And if you want to see more videos just like this, don't forget to subscribe. Check out my second channel down below in the description. I'm going to be posting a lot of product reviews and also a bunch of pranks on my family. The first prank I'm going to be doing is a Chucky prank, which I'm going to scare the shit out of everybody in my family with. But honestly, you guys will see it when it comes out. 
Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will catch you guys in the next video.